Who did you want me to meet? Hunter of the Abbey, may I formally introduce you to the Hellride. I always like to show her to all my friends and just realize that we've been so busy beating back your mom's forces, I haven't had a chance to give you an up-close look at her. Gorgeous, right? Even without the extra hell sauce, she's a beast. She is one of a kind. As are you, Robbie. Thanks, Hunter. You always make me feel like... I don't know. Like I'm part of this whole thing. Uh, don't get me wrong. I love Nico and the rest of the sons like family. But... Well... Sometimes I feel more like... Invisible by day, rattling chains by night. Know what I mean? You are not a ghost to me, Robbie. Maybe not, but I have a feeling the two of us are gonna haunt the armies of Lilith anyway. Ah, I am the web-slinging arachnid of justice. I am the fearsome spider who just ruined your day. Wait, wait. Who who owns the night. I am the eight-legged bringer of justice. I am Spider-Man. 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 Oh, hey, Hunter. Didn't see you there. Everything's fine. This is completely normal. All the top heroes do it, I'm sure. Do what? Practice their hero voice. In my case, my spider voice. I figured if I was going to be teaming up with this group, I ought to up my game. Sound more, I don't know, scary, I guess. Well, your spider voice is very noticeable. Really? Did it give you pause? Strike fear in your heart as you approach the spider's lair? It struck something. Yes! That means a lot to me, coming from you. I don't know too many demon hunters. It's nice to get an expert opinion every now and then. And if I might add an opinion of my own, you are much nicer than Craven. I actually came here to thank you. Thank me? For what? And by the way, does this thanks also involve pizza? I have to say, battling Eddie always works up the appetite. If I were to acquire this pizza, who would I give it to? Your identity remains a mystery to us all. Oh, you want to meet the spider... man beneath the mask. Sorry, that's a no-go. My true identity is a closely guarded secret. Not even MJ or Aunt May know for... Wait... I see what you're doing there. Sorry, Hunter, the mask's gotta stay on. I hope that's not gonna make things weird between us. The Abbey is a place of many secrets. Your identity is safe within these walls. It's not the walls here I'm worried about. It's out there in the real world where the people I love are. No mask can hide you or them from Lilith. Her gaze can pierce your very soul. Yeesh. Reminds me of my best friend's dad. And that was before he became a flying goblin. I know this is not easy for you, Spider-Man. The people here are very different from one another. They do not always see eye to eye. But, one thing I can say in truth, is that I trust them with my very life. Lives. Wait, did you just say lives, as in plural? Yes. I am really gonna enjoy getting to know you, Hunter. And we would enjoy getting to know you. The real you. Listen, let me think it over, alright? It's a big decision. Gotta meditate on it. Check my horoscope, roll it around in my head, and maybe we'll talk soon. Cool? Cool. I really need to think this over.
Oh, hey. Hunter, I need your help. Magic's birthday is coming up. I want to throw her a surprise party, but I can't do it alone. What do you need me to do? If you could get the other Midnight Suns on board, it would take a huge weight off my shoulders. All right. Let me know what you want. Still figuring out who and what I need, but I'll message you when I do. Probably tomorrow? Sounds good. Thanks for this. Do you have any questions? Where are we going to have the party? I'm still scouting locations, but somewhere inside the Abbey. We'll make it work. That is all I had. I'm good for now. I'm good if you're good. Thanks for this, Hunter. Can't wait to see the look on her face. Good girl, Charlie. And so you actually slept in that thing. That was probably a mistake. I kept having dreams that I was swallowed by Sandman. That's, uh, actually happened, you know. Look, man, I get it. It's not a decision to take lightly. I struggled with it for a while myself. What changed your mind? I guess I finally started trusting these fools. They may be a little crazy, but they're like family. And what about your real family? Don't you worry about what could happen? Ah, they're back in LA. Much as my kid brother Gabe would love this place, they don't know a thing. Whatever happens here, never gets back there. To be honest, I don't even think we're in the same dimension. Um, what? Uh, never mind that. Point is, this is a safe place with good people. If there's anyone who can keep a secret, it's them. Sort of comes with the territory of being a midnight sun. Most of our lives weren't sunshine and candy before Caretaker recruited us. And now we've got a gigantic, demonically-powered pizza oven in the forge. Excuse me, would you... Hey, man. It's okay. We can talk about something else if you want. Yes. Please, stay. Can't. Got something I need to do. I really thought I had him with the pizza thing. What is it with you both and Pete? Okay, you wanted it, you got it. You wanted what? I give you by popular demand, the man underneath the mask. Peter Parker from Forest Hills, Queens. Nice to see you finally ditch the spider face doily, Peter. We're all friends here. You got our attention, so what do you got to say, Petey? Um, hi? After all that build-up, I hope I didn't disappoint anybody. I mean, I can't shoot laser beams, light my skull on fire, or glow like the sun. Like Tony said, outside of the costume, I'm just boring old Peter Parker. I don't even have a cool screen name. I have seen you in battle with Venom, Peter. Believe me when I say you are anything but boring. Aw, oh, thanks. Jeez, Hunter, you trying to make me blush? I did not realize you embarrassed so easily. Oh yeah, I actually surprise myself at the things that embarrass me. Speaking of, now that we took care of the giant radioactive spider elephant in the room, we might as well get to know one another. If there's anything else you're curious to know about me, ask away. I'm apparently an open book now. So what do you say, Hunter? Care to step inside this Spider-Verse? I have encountered werewolves, half-vampires, dragon men, but I have never encountered a Spider-Man before. There must be quite a story about how you became this way. It's actually not the most epic story. Sort of a field trip gone wrong scenario, if you get me. <laughs> I do not. Well, 
A small irradiated spider bit me while I was working up the nerve to ask Mary Jane Watson if she'd like to check out the Pym Particle exhibit at the Empire State Museum. Next thing I know, the high-energy photons injected into my bloodstream started altering my genomic sequence. At first, I thought I was having an allergic reaction, and then I started climbing up the walls. I told May Aunt May it was late-onset puberty. She, uh, believed me for some reason. So, how about you? Get bit by a radioactive hunter or something? Years of discipline and training under Caretaker's guidance forged me into the warrior I am today. Caretaker is like your aunt, right? Yes. Sister to Lilith. She raised me when my mother... fell. Aunt May became my guardian after my parents... um... passed. I guess we have that in common. I suppose we do. This Venom creature's obsession with you is strong enough to overcome my mother's call. Until now, I thought that impossible. It's, uh, complicated. Eddie, the guy underneath the giant oozing mouth, was a reporter with me at the Bugle a while back. I may have ruined his career by exposing a phony source of his on this big murder case. This, of course, led him to the alien symbiote that had secretly bonded with me after my original suit was trashed on Battleworld. We can talk about that little adventure later. Long story short, I thought I had eradicated the suit with a giant church bell. Before I knew it was alive, of course. Anywho, the alien symbiote decided to merge with Eddie, and the two have been hunting me down ever since. It's your basic simple misunderstanding, right? Well, I guess every superhero needs a super nemesis. Venom is mine. It must be tough having your own mom be yours, huh? Caretaker and Agatha protected me, trained me, cared for me. All I know of Lilith is pain. Hard same, but a different kind of pain, I guess. Couldn't ask for anyone better than Aunt May and Uncle Ben, but sometimes I just wish I could have gotten to know my birth parents, even just for a second. You do not seem like a typical Avenger. Avenger? Me? Oh, no. Between my double major at Empire State, taking photos for the Bugle, and, you know, the whole protecting the neighborhood thing, who has the time? Besides, they haven't asked me to join them. Um, yet, of course. What about you? How's this whole Midnight Sun thing work? You like the captain or something? Caretaker has always handled the strategy. I prefer a more hands-on approach. Hey, whatever works for you. But if I'm honest, Hunter, I saw the way the others looked at you during the fight. Maybe you're more of a leader than you think. And just how many years has there been a Spider-Verse? Oh, you mean how long have I been doing this? A few years now. You should have seen the original suit. I'd still have it lying around the dorm somewhere. Makes a great blanket. How about you? How long have you been... hunting? At this point, I suppose I am well over three centuries old. That is, if you count the years spent above and below ground, of course. Of course! I mean, whatever gets you senior discount sooner, am I right? You are a fascinating man. Ooh, I like that. Friendly neighborhood, fascinating man. I wonder if Stark owns that trademark yet. Thank you, Peter. I should be going. This was eye-opening. For both of us? I gotta thank you too, Hunter. I was sort of holding back before. You know, didn't want to be a chatty Charlie. 
But now the floodgates are open. Let the real Peter Parker flow through. Anyway, um, you gotta go. I'll talk to you soon. Of that, I have no doubt. Farewell, Peter. Good chatting with you, Hunter. Ah, Hunter, I was just admiring the collection. Someone spent a great deal of time piecing this library together. I hope you don't mind me, uh, having a look around. Of course not, Doctor. The library is an asset to us all. I see I'm not the only one who's taken an interest in these works. You haven't been getting into anything precarious, I hope. We... I've found something on the Abbey grounds that I think you should see. Oh, sounds mysterious. By all means, lead the way. I typically avoid venturing this far from the Abbey, especially at night. It makes Tony nervous, you see. There's an unsettling air about this place. This church belonged to a preacher named Hiram Shah. His influence turned Salem against its coven. A charismatic personality and a beautiful populace can do much evil together. There was more to it than that. Yes, I suspected as much. Not in the, I'm concerned about your personal well-being, Dr. Sense. You were right to bring this to my attention, Hunter. We thought it resembled one of your wards of protection. There's a reason for that. It's the same magic Wanda invoked in her attempts to protect the Sanctum. But what is it that you're chasing out here? These wards aren't something to toy with. I will not know for sure until I get past this. Is there any way to dispel it? Unfortunately, no. What good would the wards of protection be if they were so easily broken? But I have been wrong before, at least recently. Do you have any suspicions as to who may have conjured this here? Wanda spent a great deal of time out here, and she had the power. She does have some experience with these spells, but why would she do that? The only way I will know for sure is to find a way through to the other side. I'll think on it and see if I can come up with some way to assist you, Hunter. For now, though, you'll have to be patient. You are welcome to attend Ileana's surprise party. As much as I would enjoy that, my presence unsettles those incapable of perceiving me. I'll celebrate from afar. So you will be there in spirit? Oh, Hunter, how I've missed your wit. Calm down, Robbie. The others are in there with freaking Caretaker planning their next move against Faustus, and they are totally leaving us out. Again! But this is the Avengers we're talking about, right? They're heroes. <sighs> and who had to bail out those heroes when your new pal Spider-Man was being chased by the alien slime monster? Us! Got you there. If they are so powerful, why could Strange not help us save Wanda? Look, Doc's a good guy, okay? He's patched up a spider in a year two since I started this thing. Flaming pumpkin bombs are not exactly covered by insurance. I would not trust him to patch a tire. They move into our home, take it over, and then have the nerve to leave us out of every single damn decision that affects us. You two want to cozy up to Mr. Stark and Doctor Strange? Go right ahead. Me, I'll be outside. Most of the air's been sucked up from here already. I realize this isn't a formal military organization like Hydra, but when it comes to the recent behavior of Nico and magic, the word insubordination comes to mind. 
Wanda is their friend. I'd be more concerned if they weren't unhappy with the situation. Then you agree with them? With their approach? I might have done the same. Like you said, this isn't the military. You can give orders, but at the end of the day... Hydra forces are transferring some of their equipment out of this area, and you have a chance to intercept it. You'll have to move quickly if we're going to recover any of their equipment. Consider it done. Watch and learn. I'm on it. Not a problem. You've secured one of the crates. See if you can't get the others.
They've armed one of the crates. It's going to explode if you don't get that key. one of the crates. See if you can't get the others. his arm to detonate. Get to that key card. Didn't think I could get any stronger. on getting the other keys.
keep hearing about this guy. The teeth, the slime, the eat your brains commentary. Time to see if the hype is true. shipment Hydra won't be receiving. <laughs> <laughs> 